Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back to Deer Park Daily. I'm Caroline Plunkett. And I'm Samia McLeod. This week, we will have more daily motivations. We take another scroll around campus, discuss our out upcoming cooking class, and we continue our Women's History Month spotlight. We kick things off with daily motivation. Well, hey there, buckaroos. Today is just a little reminder for you. Whether it's chicken sitting or giving your thumb carpal tunnel by scrolling your phone, you need to stay connected to your hobbies. It's very easy to lose track of what you enjoy doing and even easier to remember to try new things. A good place to start cooking something you've never made before. Speaking of cooking, let's send it over to Jackie for news about an upcoming cooking class. Hey everyone, in April, we will be having a family cooking night. You will be able to learn how to make some tasty treats and some great cooking tips and tricks. Mr. Dees shared with us in an exclusive Deer Park Daily interview that his class has gotten a head start on. Be sure to stay tuned to Deer Park Daily for more information. We would love to see and hear what motivates you. Submit pictures or quotes that motivate you to Mr. Veroni and it could be featured on our daily motivation segment. Hey everyone, it's time to take a stroll around campus with me, Alyssa Madero, and today's guest is our assistant principal, Ms. Majeka. Hi! And let's take a stroll, y'all. Okay, so the first question I got for you is, how long have you been at Deer Park? I have been at Deer Park beginning of this school year, and before that, I worked in a different department, and I used to come and check on all the new teachers. So a lot of kids who have seen me before know me from all the new teachers that I worked with last year. Pretty you see. I was a teacher way back in the day. I taught special education, but um, last year and the previous year, I worked with new teachers and mentors. Okay, and why are yawns contagious? Why do you think yawns are contagious? What's contagious? Yawn. Like, what are you talking about? Like, are you like sleepy? Oh, yawn. Oh, yeah. like, oh, because I think a yawn is contagious because it makes other people think that you're tired, even though you're not. And then everybody's got to be tired and they take a collective nap. And if you could have any job in the world, what would you do? Like, what would you do? Any job in the world, the best job I have right now at Deer Park Middle. I would be a famous singer, like Brianna. A famous singer? You know how to sing? No. <laughs> but you didn't say how to be good at it. Okay. Yeah, you're right. Um, and if you were the last person on earth, what would you do? If I was the last person on earth? Yes. I would probably write a book. A book about what? Being lonely. Lonely? Lonely. So why are you lonely? Because I'm the last person on earth. <laughs> Right, right. <laughs> and yeah, this is Show Around Campus with me, Alyssa Medeiros. I'll see you next time. Deer Park Gailey is looking for a new logo contest and we want you to create it. Submit your logo to Mr. Veroni by March 31st in order to enter the Deer Park Gailey logo contest. Get creative and have fun with it. Last week, Joint Base Charleston did two female flights and jumps. Joint Base Charleston has been celebrating women in the military for the entire month in, of March and honor Women's History Month. The flights include women from Line 61 and Air 82 Airborne Division. The mission has been praised, recognizing the contributions and capabilities of women in the military. Carla Alberto Lopez, Jackie Cruz, and Alyssa Merderos. I'm Tamia McLeod. And I'm Caroline Plunkett. Remember, do it for the daily. That's the news, everyone.